Hello friends, welcome to Knowledge World again. Here uh, we are going to learn a little bit more about the Google Groups as uh, till now we have learned uh, like you should have your Gmail ID, you will go to the Google Groups, you will subscribe or join the groups and you need to copy that uh, the address of that group. So like uh, now we will be doing how we will be emailing to those groups. So just want to show that so I'll be doing two or three uh, Google Groups related things uh, so you can catch out the things accordingly. Here uh, my groups are there. If you have not copied, so you will copy all the groups in this way. 29 groups I have subscribed. Copy. And in Google you will go, you will go to extract emails. You will go to this tool you can copy uh, you can re uh, remember this uh, url so we'll paste here extract email and then your groups would be coming whatever you have taken till now to your uh, subscription pass part or uh, joining part then you will go to the compose you will put it in bcc as so many groups are there you have joined already and you will email whatever you want to email like let's say uh, these requirements are coming so people must have sent on the groups so let me like email to this and uh, just for sample i'm doing this or uh, let's say i'm just going to ask to all people are you dealing with direct right And I'll be sending this. So it means it has gone to the so many people who were there in the membership of these groups. So as I told you, one group can be joined with more than 10,000 or so much people as well. So like those people would be getting like let's see this group has 9036 members so means i have sent to 9036 members if i have sent on this group as well let's say like i'm checking for the another group this group may be having two two one zero five it is having the members so it is going them as well so hope you understood like in short if i calculate so i have sent to thirty thousand plus members if i will go to also i think it should reach more than thirty thousand people so same manner you can email them and uh, just remember always try to mention the email address in the body as i did not mention there so like let's say i'm checking here this person has sent the email somewhere so obviously you need to put your signature or something let me open any google group email yeah this person has sent on google group so you can see this is coming here so it means google group has been used so this person used signature here with his email id so same manner you will be using your email address or whatever you want to put here so the person can reply on this because otherwise he will be replying on the gmail and you'll be getting on the gmail so some you'll be not able to filter there because so many emails will be coming regular basis there so better to put here so people like many of uh, the recruiters they will pick the email from here and uh, the bottom side you can see here if someone wants to unsubscribe so they do have option here already it would be coming automatically for them as well so i hope it would it was helpful for you in next video i'll be making uh, own group like uh, if you want to make your own group so how you can use that and uh, what is the use of your own personal group like people are creating these groups so how they made actually so what is the use of that we'll be learning in that uh, video which will be posted after that so stay tuned try to subscribe soon and please comment and like if you like the videos thank you thanks for watching